Welcome back to my channel. So it's been a while since you guys have seen my face. I just realized the video I'm about to post does not have an introduction. So I just thought I would jump on here and introduce it. I'm showing you how I do my art on a budget. So if you're looking to just improve, um, get artwork for well, get artwork for your room or whatever, watch the video. And yeah, forgive all this. <laughs> like comment and subscribe guys and watch till the end okay, so hmm, home decor in progress so if you had seen my previous room then you had seen all this were forming part of one gallery wall so i had to take them down and this is what this is the old stuff basically there was a lot. This was my background. This was from my background's mm -hmm. filming space. This. That. And then this, this was part of the gallery wall. So now I'm switching things around. So rather than do... Because my space right now isn't the same. I'm switching things around. I'm doing this three prints. Um, so I'm doing these three so they won't go together these two so I want to put let me just show you so the, this one this one will stay as is it will go up here then I'll put two here uh, and then one is going to my bedroom and then this small one which I think I'll definitely repaint the frame to black is going up here next to this because I have a this is round, so I want something square and then I'll probably do something triangle. And then the rest of this wall, I have different, a completely different plan for it. And I should put a tiny little desk over here to be my workspace. Yes, so I need to do a DIY as well. Of um, what are these things called? the mesh thingy so i need a vision board i haven't i've been working without a vision board this whole time uh it's been crazy because i've not been organized for a very long time so <laughs> this is an impromptu tour this is my living space as it is right now that's my couch there's a whole story so i'll try and insert the how i got everything oh, that's me over there hi so i got how i got my couch and my seeds which are still a work in progress then i have this which i need to add plants and then this project which i would already finished so my one of the dilemmas i'm having is this this um electricity box thingy it is an iso i am considering spray painting it white so that it just sort of blends into the background and isn't Visible. So for now, my living room is my major project. Um, I'm trying to get it finished first, and then I'll do my bedroom eventually. But as time goes by and as I run into pieces, then I'll definitely update. Um, my kitchen is also a work in progress. I'll show you that when I, as soon as I start working on it. But for the most part, um, aside from getting appliances and possibly just doing two other rooms i'll show you how it goes so yeah so this is the house project it's actually happening <laughs> you guys uh, oh i love this Ooh. this is going in my room in my bedroom i didn't have anything hung up in my bedroom yet yeah and i can't wait to switch this this is a gift this is actually a gift from my best friend kathy from the uk um yeah so it's no longer working with my aesthetic i mean i feel i feel like for my room previously the whole fashion thing worked because i was kind of in my rebellious stage where i was just putting myself in a mind in a mindset of fashion but now i'm looking at it more in a more wholesome way in terms of i have more rooms to decorate so i have to <laughs> be diverse but my art more or less comes from Pinterest, uh, my frames more or less come from Thailand carpet, except I think these ones, these ones were from 
Naivas, I spray painted them and they were very cheap actually. They must have been 150, 180. I spray painted them. Uh, the white one was about 220, 250, I'm not sure. But Thailand carpet has very, very cheap um, frames. Everyone is always asking me on my Insta stories when they see them, where are your frames from? Thailand carpet, that's it. Uh, this, are my, this is actually my most expensive frames. They are about 750 each. Um, I got two, two of them for 750. That, those are the last two from Garden City. And then the other two I got from Thailand Capit in Lavington. Um, I think they still have these left. Um, they haven't really disappeared off the shelves like the others. The others I took, once I took my four, I've never been able to find them again. And okay, so this is the before. That's all the art. What I'm replacing it with, so this is for this tiny frame. I'm sorry, this has to go. I also, I think I'll spray paint this as well. And yeah, I choose my art. I like to have it um, sort of mean something. So each of these pieces was or sort of made me feel some type of way, and I'll explain. This reminds me of December and my. Uh, four locks and the space bands this is who I, I feel like I look like or I want to look like <laughs> yes I've put on weight um, not nearly as well defined as her but you never know and this is me when I'm doing the glasses thing and the curly hair this is just abstract have to redo this one so one more thing that's important that i forgot to know to tell you is that i use this is what i use to hang up my art um what you do you just put it up against the wall you hit the nails and then they come out on this other side in, and anchor right into the wall um usually they're really really small but this is a bigger size when i when i'm getting this i got i didn't get the same um make as i normally do so this is a different one and yeah well i needed them so i just had to get um thing is they'll be really they're white they blend with the wall so i can kind of get away with uh leaving them in the wall when i eventually move out or since the walls the holes made are tiny i can just fill fill them up and yeah that's it so yeah let's get building this is what I'm talking about that I've been using to hang my paintings and artwork, even in my old room. Um, I don't like this brand. The other one was in a yellow pack. They're both from Garden City though, game. So for the most part, I wing it when I'm just doing individual um, Stuff. When, I'm hang when I'm hanging a gallery wall, the, I always measure, like I measure the distance between each uh, of the <laughs> frames. I measure the distance from where it's going to hang. Uh, it's a lot. This is all of them complete. Finally, um, I made spaces for them with the hooks. That I talked about then for this one since it doesn't have a place to hook it in the back I'll be using double-sided tape and it's going to go up here next to the rose gold watch just to play the clock <laughs> just to play on the, the pink pinkishness so um, I think the next thing I should add to this space is something triangular just to play off with the shapes because that's circular that's square and then something in a completely different shape and then the um, mesh will go under here and it will be rectangular so yeah that's playing with our geometrics and our metals and our all of that so i'm debating uh painting this black i think it will look really nice next to the rose gold clock 
I'm not so sure I still like it as it is. Um, let's see where what I decide. But yes. That's in the last video that I didn't show you the end uh, where I ended up hanging this wall hangings and yeah that's one those are the other two that's the third one and yes so let me just explain one thing um so basically what i did is i printed out the images and replaced them in the frame and then i hung them up that's it i got my images off of pinterest um i made sure that i downloaded them in uh, high res and then i um and they are fitted to each frame so i use i usually use just word i just print it on word um it's not too complicated anyone can do it just print it on word just make sure you when you're expanding or you you don't actually when you're trying to enlarge your image don't pull pull it like go to the properties and change the details there there's actually uh it's actually a, uh, something you can use to change it. I don't know how to explain. So anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. If you want more home decor videos um, and house updates, I'll be, I'm right here. I'll be filming more. I'm so sorry I don't show my face these days. <laughs> I'll be back though with a live update and a story time. Make sure you like, comment and subscribe. Bye.